Hi everyone. Today I'm making a video on a haul. I love these videos myself when I'm watching YouTube and I love to see like all the drugstore hauls, things that other people get. It gives me ideas of what to get myself. Um, so I got a couple of things from CVS and uh, from TJ Maxx and from Dwayne Reed. Um, so let's start with the Dwayne Reed. I got two products. Here I got these eyebrow shapers, Studio 35. They come three in a pack, but I used one already. These are good like uh, to shave your face, like if you have any hairs around here. These are great to take them out. The other one that I got to try out are these eyelashes from Andrea. They're the deluxe pack. I like them like this. They're really full. I don't usually wear eyelashes on a daily basis, but when I do, I really like them to be dramatic and thick and long. So these are really nice um, because, see myself, I already have like long lashes. But when I do wear them, I like them like this. Okay, next is CVS. First and foremost, I got this, the Nivea Men, the post-shave balm that I see everyone talking about in you on YouTube, about using this as a primer, and I'm very excited to try this. Uh, it was $7.79 at my CVS. But I have sensitive skin, so hopefully it works out for me. Um, but I'm really, really excited to try this. Uh, next, I got... I took it out of the package already, but it is the Duo Black Eyelash Adhesive. Because the white one, I don't like it. But this one comes like this. It's like a little brush. And you could just apply it on and then stick those bad boys on. So that one I like, and this I also got to try it out, uh, is the Maybelline Graphic, and I figured I'd give it a try. Um, it's like a marker, and it's waterproof, a liquid marker eyeliner for bold graphic lines, um, is the Striking Black. Next is from... NYX, I had gotten this one, Tame and Frame, is a tinted brow pomade, so hopefully, I got the, which color is this, it has, it's like espresso, it has to be dark, I didn't want to get the black, cause black on your eyebrows, I don't know, it's too much for me, I like the dark brown, I wear dark brown fillers and everything else I usually do is dark brown, but not black. Unless it's my eyeliner or mascara. Okay, uh, next I got from Milani. They had a sale. Buy one, get 50% off the other. So I bought a couple of things from Milani. First thing I got from Milani is this. Um, I hear a lot about this also on YouTube. And uh, it's the Conceal and Perfect 2 in 1 foundation. I got it in the 01 Creamy Vanilla. I'm really light skin. I'm actually looking tan with this light. But believe me when I tell you, I'm very, very fair skin. So hopefully this isn't too dark for me. But yeah, it's the number one creamy vanilla. And I'm very, very anxious to try this one. I love makeup. Oh my god, I love makeup. This is my weakness. But um can't wait to try this. I haven't used it yet because I wanted to do this whole video first. Uh, next I got this, what is this, Milani eyeliner. This is it right here. And black is black. And I'm very amped. I'm just going to rip it. I'm just going to rip it open. I want to see how black it is. The packaging is nice. I saw all the other ones were black, but then I saw this gold packaging on it. And I was like, I want that one. 
So let's see how this works. Oh, that's great. And see. It's it's like butter. It's very, very, very soft. Oh, I kind of already it was a real point point and now it's it's like butter though. It's okay. It's the ones that you you don't have to sharpen it. See that? Which that's always great. Cause the worst is when your pencil's running out and you feel like the the wood chips on it and you feel like you're gonna rip your eye open and stuff. But this one is great. You guys if you guys are interested in looking for one. Now next is this what is this? A uh, Milani eyebrow pencil. Automatic pencil and is water resistant. Is it open? Oh, okay, great. And it comes with a little schoolie, <laughs> spruily, schoolie, something. A little brush at the end, which is it's like a duo, which is great. Uh, this one is in dark brown because I don't like using black on my eyebrows. Um, so let me try this one. Okay, it's a very nice color. My hands are dry. I was cleaning. But that's it right here. Over, let's see, it's, it's nice. Very nice, soft. So it should go on well. That's good like for drawing out. Drawing it out before you fill it in and stuff. I usually do my eyebrows better, but for video purposes, I did it fast. Now, uh, this Milani Brow Shaping Clear Gel. I'm trying to get my eyebrow game up, as you can see. Got the pomade, got the eye pencil, the eyebrow pencil with the little schoolie brush, whatever it's called, and the clear gel. So, this is it right here. Hopefully, in my next couple of videos. My eyebrows are on perfection. But right now, mm, they could be better. Okay, next. I got this Milani. I took it out of the packaging already. Boo to me. I try, I try. Wait for the holes. But, okay, I really, really wanted to try this one. This is the Milani Liquid Eye Liner Pencil. And it's in, what color is this? Purple. The 07 purple. So this is it right here. I love purple. Makes the eye stand out. Also a retractable pencil. See? Hey, is it broken? No. No. What happened? Work. Work. It's only a tiny little... T this is... Ah! What happened? Okay, 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 it's working, it's working. No, 911 right now is working. See? Okay, I put it up too high. Hope it goes down. Come on, come on, baby. Come on. Ah! I broke it. Shit! Excuse my language. <sighs> well, it's working. Um, let me test this one out. Uh, wow, you see? It's a liquid pencil and it glides right on. But, come on, show the color. You see the purple? It got like some glitter on it. But it's great. Can't wait to try it. Can't wait to fix it. For the video, I play with it and I fix it. Okay. Next one is also from Milani. This is the Color Statement Lip Liner True Instant Color. And is in the number 04. And it's the All Natural. This is the pencil right here. It's like butter. Color. Come on. The color is so pretty. It's always nice to have like an old nude color just because it kind of goes with every lipstick. You just line your lips, put whatever lip color you want, some lip gloss, and then it all blends in nicely. So it's a nice color to it. Now that's it for my CVS. Next is TJ Maxx. I went to TJ Maxx yesterday and I saw some. I got a couple of little goodies. This one is the Vintage Cosmetic Company 
Kitty lashes. They look pretty nice, right? Natural, shorter ones, longer ones. So it could all kind of just blend in and look delicious. <laughs> but, um, yeah, these came out to $3.99. TJ Maxx. Good old TJ Maxx. Can't wait to try those. Um, next, I got me some of these. Of course, the eyebrow razors. I got me a two-pack. These are the Stella. Stella Fiesta. Right here is three packs of the razors. Once I started testing that out, I was like, oh my gosh. I have to store these bad boys in my house. Because if, God forbid, I can't ever go out or have to... Or if I run out of them, I gotta have backups. Ladies, if you're using these, the glare is crazy. If you're using these, have backups, okay? Now, I got two because look at that. Woohoo! $3. They were on clearance. I don't know why. Packaging wasn't open. It's like taped down. They look pretty good. Of course, I will probably disinfect them before it's frying them. But yeah, these are it right here. Three dollars clearance. Can't go wrong. Next, I got these. Let me get this bag out of the way so you don't hear the <laughs> from the bags. But anyway, uh, I got these. Uh, am I late on these? I think I am. Probably. But these are the Profusion Eyes. I've never tried this brand. I do have all of the Urban Decay palettes. Uh, but these are my first actual palette like this. Uh, paying $6.99 for. I was like, hey, I'm going to try these bad boys. And if I don't like them, I'm not going to cry. Because I didn't pay $60, $70 for them. Now, um, this is the colors on it. Okay, let's see, let's see. Let's cut this plastic out of here. This was me. It was not used. I know there are a lot of people. Shame on you. If you're one of those people that go testing makeup at a department store or pharmacy or I mean well drugstore anywhere if you put your finger on it you're ruining it for everybody if you don't buy it now I always make sure that they're not touched but this one right here that was me love pink and when I saw that eyeshadow I had to test it out but I did it after I bought it after I bought it while I was in the, while I was in the car I was like, do, 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 gotta try if it's pigmented, and it kind of is. I did, let me check it out again one more time for you. They are pigmented. <laughs> it's okay. They are, um, it's not like powdery, dusty, so let's just see. Hopefully there's not fallouts or anything, but I did like the choice of colors. There are some matte finished ones, some with glitter, so I'm pretty sure, I mean, there's some beautiful colors in here, there really are, and uh, you can't go wrong for $6.99, but look at this color, look at those colors, do you know how many looks I can make with this, ah, and $6.99, and not for nothing, I must add this, this brush is not a cheapy brush, this blending brush, very soft, this right here, very soft. Soft and sturdy, just great. You pack that color in there, flip this bad boy over. Great blending brush. So I'm happy about the brush. There could be fallout. I mean, you can work with fallout and everything. You can work with all that. If you guys have skill, you can work with that. Okay, the case is nice also. Love it. Let's see how it... Let's see how it sets and if it lasts. Okay, now this one is the W7. And I know I'm probably late on these guys. But I just saw it and picked it up. The W7 in the night. Tin can. 
six ninety nine. Oh, gotta start doing daytime videos. Six ninety nine. And okay, the pencil. Don't like it. But these are the colors. Let's see. You have the white, gold. These are more like glitter, 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 glitter. Are they all glitter? Yep, ladies and gentlemen, they all have glitter. All of them? It's okay. <laughs> they all have glitter. See? Do, 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 do. The colors are beautiful. Let's see. Let's test this bad boy. Of course, I'm going to test the pink one. I don't know. I don't know. It looks powdery. But nothing that a blending brush can't take care of, right? I could try to work with this one. Let's see how it works out. But yeah, this was my haul for the weekend. Oops, there's my phone. Um, and that's all. Let me know if you guys have any questions about any of the products that I got. Uh, just comment down below. I'll respond to everything because I live on YouTube. <laughs> so show me some love. That's it. Subscribe and see you guys on the next video. Mwah.